Oh, hey people! How's it going? Yep, it is me, the person behind video game Stupid. A very, very channel of lots of Let's Play videos and stuff. Now I'm doing a vlog! I don't know you know why. I've been watching a lot of Sweezy's videos lately. Because I haven't been able to do any Let's Plays at all. Sucks balls, but you know, it's just what happens. So I've just been watching a lot of Sweezy's videos. I've watched like, I think I've watched like almost every single one in the course of like a week. That's literally how addictive I've, I've been, like... There's like 183 videos, I think I watched at least like 170, 150, something like that. I've just been watching a lot of his videos, because I can't stop watching them. But, you know, I think I have the vlogging, blo the vlogging bug and stuff, so I've just been like, doing this video, this update video to tell you what's going on. No, I did not stop doing Let's Plays, so I will, at the moment, current situation doesn't allow me to actually do Let's Plays at any time of the day at all. Like, this is really the only time of the day because there's nobody in the house right now, it's like, absolutely nobody in the house whatsoever so I actually have time to at least sit down and do like this video vlog or you know I can just do whatever and stuff and right now I'm probably I'm not gonna be doing any let's plays for like another month or so I know it's been like at least two months since I haven't done a let's play I've done like it's been like a month since I've done like a video but there's gonna be like a, uh, another month before I can actually maybe two months I'm not even sure at this point it's ridiculous this is some badness in here complete utter Shit. Uh, yeah, anyway, so, yeah, pretty much tonight, I'm just doing this video, and then probably later on, I'll probably do, like, um, something with Team Ning Guiders, probably do, like, a little co-op thing with, them, with <laughs> Nick and stuff with Team Ning Guiders, they got some pretty good stuff, so go check them out, they're pretty awesome, and, um, yeah, anyway, so, um, also, supposed to give a shout to Nostalgia Gamer JS. He does a lot of Oblivion videos, so if you like Oblivion, go check him out. He's got some pretty good stuff, so I'll leave a link in the description bar to his channel. And go check him out and stuff. And let's see, what else is there in New York on... Oh! Let's see, I got these two gems today. This camera. I can't see with my glasses, I'm trying to figure out the camera actually... It's showing both the games on the screen at the same time. Yeah, I'm showing it. Alright, yep, I got these two gems today. Resident Evil 1, I got this, like, yesterday. I'm playing all day yesterday. I played it so much, I'm like, Oh my god! Come on, so Got it from eBay for, like, I think, like, at least, like, 14 bucks. Not too bad. And I got Resident Evil 0 today. I got it, like, hours ago, but I didn't check the mail till like, 5 o'clock today. I haven't even played the game. I just opened up the package and read the manual, and that was pretty much it. So I gotta play that tonight, and I'm gonna finish this probably tonight too as well because I love Resident Evil. You know, I've been playing Resident Evil 5, and you know, it's just not—it's—it's it's not Resident Evil for me anymore. It's not scary. It's just action-oriented. You know, a lot of people will argue that you know it's probably the best Resident Evil game ever, but probably those same people that are saying it's the best Resident Evil game ever are the same people only put Resident Evil when Resident Evil 4 came out. You know, I've been playing it since like. Uh, I haven't been playing. I haven't been playing it since like the 90s because you know I was like eight around that time. But I mean, the first Resident Evil game I ever, I ever actually saw being played was when my cousin, like, in like I think like my cousin visited, came from Florida to visit, and we rented. I had a Dreamcast at the time, and we rented um, Resident Evil Code Veronica for a Dreamcast, and I watched him play it, and I was scared. I was like scared shitless. I'm like, oh my god, this game is so fucking scary. It was the first Resident Evil I ever actually saw played. It was so scared that when he went to the bathroom, he told me to like do stuff on the game and stuff. All I did was run around in a circle, and I got scared and threw the controller just from running in a circle. Like I just I tried running around and it just it it, it scared me so much. Like I couldn't even play the game anymore. But sometime around then I started playing the, the actual main series. Well, Cobra gets part of the main series, but like to zero I played one, two, three and stuff, and then. Ever since I've been hooked to Resident Evil, so... It's like being at home again, playing these again, because I haven't played it since, like, 2004 or something. It's been that long. <laughs> really. But anyway, um... Got these two gems. Gonna play them all night tonight. Woo! And, um... Let's see. Uh, usually in these type of videos... People will ask a lot of questions. Like, why am I wearing this outfit? Or, like... Uh, why is it so dimly lit? Well, you know, I'm gonna be asking the questions this time around. No, I'm gonna be asking the fucking questions. Alright, question number one. 
Why does Wario, let's play Wario Land bullshit whatever game I did, why does I have like so many views? The first part has like a thousand views. It's ridiculous. It's like, I don't have that much, I don't have that many subscribers, but it's like, it has that many views. And there was even one comment in the video where someone was like, Eeeh! Eeeh! So is Bannock Sapphire! He's Bannock Fucking Down this video! Eeeh! Yeah, it's got a thousand views, and it's got like, I don't know, like Ghostbusters, that's, that's when I actually worked my ass off on, like, I worked hard trying to find, um, a ROM that had voice acting in it, wink wink, but, yeah, that only has like so many views, you know? But, Wario is just like, I'm not saying that it's a bad Let's Play, but I'm just saying that. How has it got a thousand views, but other videos don't have as many views, I don't know. Maybe people just like Wario or something now, I, I really don't, I don't, I don't fucking know anymore. And, oh, uh, let's see, what is question number two? Question number two is, I'm gonna plan, I'm planning on doing uh, another Let's Play of Mugen sometime soon in the future, but, I want to know from you people, what do you want to see in Let's Play Mugen? Like, seriously, tell me. What do you want to see? Because, you know, I, I've just been doing it like a just... A random thing, pretty much. Except for Part 4, which is basically... It was a Michael Jackson theme-based Let's Play, but... Part 5, you know, I just want to see what the... What, what do you want from Mugen, Let's Play Mugen Episode 5? Like, seriously, who do you want to see in there? Who do you want, who do you want to see me playing as? Who do you want to see my partner as? Uh, do you want survival mode? Do you want me to do, like, a... Just an entire survival mode and see how far I can get and then just end it. You want me to do a team play arcade mode? You want me to do like a freaking CPU tournament mode? Because I do those a lot in my, in my, um, sometimes I get bored. Like, I'll just randomly choose CPUs and I'll make them fight each other and do like a tournament thing and like see who finally, who, see who's the winning team is and stuff. It's kind of fun actually, but, you know, do you want to see that? Just, just let me know in the comments and stuff, you know? And question number three, um, um, Probably sometime, not anytime soon, but sometime in the near future, you know, somewhere down the line. I'll probably do, like, another Let's Play of Dungeon Fighter Online Episode 2, where I go through Sky Tower and stuff, but who, uh, I can at least, who do you, who, do you want to be in the Let's Play or not? Because cause it's a MMO game, it's online, you have a choice of whether or not you want to be in it and stuff. Like, just send me a comment, send me a personal message if you want to, show, tell me a character name, tell me what part you want to be, tell me like what stage you want to do it on and stuff because, you know, there's like, for Sky Tower, there's like, not too many, there's only like five or six stages, I can't remember, I haven't played DFO in like a, like a month now and stuff, but, you know, there's like plenty of stages, so just tell me like your character name, um, what stage you want to do on Sky Tower and stuff because episode two will probably mainly consist only of Sky Tower because... Well, it's just enough to cover and stuff. How much time is left? Alright, still plenty of time left to ramble on. <laughs> Alright, so anyway, um, those are my three questions, and, um, let's see. The three questions, what else do I want to say? Oh, oh, also, 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 if you are an anime fan, if you're a fan of anime and you like comedy, you need to go check out this channel. Let me go, um, link to it right now. Uh, let's see. Alright, so let's see right down here. Um, triple note, I have a channel called Blah Blah Blah. And, go check out this channel. This shit, this is a new channel I made and stuff. I used to have an Amphitanska S channel, but I closed that down now. And now I have a anime voiceover show channel. So, pretty much just me and my friends doing dub parodies. Unscripted, right? Unscripted and random, so it's like whatever is whatever's on our mind, we just say for other voiceover and stuff. But you know, we choose different characters and then we like, you know, say whatever the hell we want to say. There's me being bad, but not saying anything that makes any sense <laughs> because he's a fucking bat. Why? What is that to make sense? I'm gonna clip some other random part. And um, here's my buddy Hugs being Sada. Being as crazy as ever. <laughs> yep. And then, let's see what's here. What's up, everybody here, guys? 
Yeah, yeah this. <laughs> Condoms. Everyone's staring at him. It actually fits too. It's like he just rarely steals out condoms, and everyone's like, "What the fuck?" And it's like some of the random shit we say actually kind of fits, but most of the time it's just fucking random. We feel like random unscripted anime comedy that makes fun of anime. Then you know, go check out this channel. Oh come on! I can't fucking see. I uh, cut the one more random part now. I'm gonna close hey, out. Uh, you forget. I'm not sending friends of mine. I'm very sorry. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Whoa, what? <laughs> I know what I said, but it was pretty dirty. That's all I remember. It was really fucking dirty. You have to go actually watch a show yourself with headphones. Watch on headphones, because you know, if you don't watch with headphones, you're not gonna hear too much because of the music. But if you watch with headphones, you will hear everything. You hear the music, you hear the voices, you hear the randomness. Randomness, it'll be awesome, people. Just, just do it. So, that's all I'm gonna say for now. If I'll be doing let's plays, let's plays for like another month or two now and stuff. I might do something with Team Ninja tonight because that's the only time I actually have time to do it due to a certain situation. Fuckers. But anyway, so. That's all I gotta say now, and see you guys later.